I'm here with freshman guard Trayvon Allen. Trayvon, you played really hard tonight as well as last week in the black and gold scrimmage. Um, how's it feel to get out here and kind of showcase your talents in front of Vandal fans for the first time? Uh, it was a great experience overall, I would say, uh, especially having so many people come up from, you know, Lapware, where I'm from, and uh, getting the chance to play for Coach V, and then with these guys on the, the court in front of uh, Moscow is uh, a great experience. I mean, granted, I got to play with them over in China. I think playing in front of a home crowd is a huge difference, and you just want to, you know, show them what you can do and uh, enjoy the game. So. And then I understand that um, your parents uh, went here, your dad played here in the 90s, and then also, like you said, being close to home, was that two kind of big deciding factors when you wanted to finally decide to come here? Oh, yeah, for sure. I mean, that was one of my main things was uh, in choosing. Is, um, both my parents went here, so, uh, you know, mine's kind of following the footsteps. Although they never really pushed me, you know, to say, you know, this is the school I should go to. They, you know, told me it was my decision to create my own story. But, uh, yeah, it had a huge uh, factor in because I wanted, you know, fans to be able to come and watch. And uh, so being so close, uh, I was glad to have, see a lot of people that I knew here tonight. Nice. And then um, you were a standout at Clarkson High. Uh, won two state championships there as well as a league player of the year in 2015. But coming here as a freshman, what kind of you, what kind of have you had to develop in your game? Uh, just making everything more uh, crisp and uh, kind of to the point, you know. Uh, everything's got to be, you know, what's the word I'm looking for? It's kind of uh, real sharp, you know what I mean? I mean, it goes simple from a crossover to a pass. Everything's got to be crisp because the guys are a lot faster, you know, they're stronger. And I think that just comes with time, you know, just in my game. And so I'm hoping, you know, but you know, towards as once we get into the season and kind of towards the end of it, I really you know I'm able to adjust my game and uh, make plays. So, and then looking forward to the end of the season, what are some uh, individual goals as well as team goals that you have? I mean, our team goals for sure to win that Big Sky Championship. I mean, I think we got the team to do it. Uh, where you know they, they came close last year and lot uh, lost a tough one. And then uh, individually, you know, I just want to do what I do what I can do you know to help the team win you know, overall, you know, the best I can possibly do it. So. Nice. And then finally, you know, just being a young guy, a lot of times you kind of get a hard time from the older guys. Is that, have you kind of felt that so far being on the team? Have they given you any, uh, any flack or anything? Uh, no, it's not, it hasn't been too bad. I'm sure once season gets going, it'll be like that. But, uh, you know, just hear, you know, things here and there. Come on, freshman. Come on, young guy. And so stuff like that. But uh, other than that, you know, that's about it. And you know, I'm having a great time playing with them. So. Well, thanks a lot, Trayvon. I'm Joe Langworthy. And here with, the, here with Inside the Vandals, uh, the Vandals take on Lewis and Clark next week.